What's up guys and welcome back to Paper Mario Color Splash and today we're going to be heading into Indigo Underground. In the last episode we found the second out of three missing key toads and we also found another purple toad, second out of three there, and we found a lot of secrets in general. We found the blue star in Port Prisma which unlocked the Indigo Underground which we're going to go ahead and explore right now which is where I'm presuming we're going to need to use the plunger thing. So hopefully we can use it here and get a good use out of it. Yay! Ah, okay, this looks like it's gonna work exactly how I expected to. We're gonna go under the water, under the ground, really. Into the sewer, basically. Well, I mean, we're going underground, yeah. But this is cool, it's the first underground area of the game. So hopefully it's nice and cool. I've been loving the contrast of different places you can go so far. And I'm just trying to look for any paintable spots, but that looks like all of it, so let's go! Going down a pipe, too, this is the first time going down a pipe. Um, excuse me? Can I help you? What is this? Oh wait, it's a toad. Isn't it? It's just upside down. Oh, jeez, he's really stuck in it. Hey, cut it out! Don't pull so hard, you're gonna tear my legs off. Can't you find another way to get me out of there with some sort of suction device or something? I don't care what you use as long, what you have to do, just unclog this stupid pipe. I know exactly what I gotta do. We're gonna use the plunger. So, what do you know? Plungers unclog pipes. And then of course we used the plunger in the previous episode as well to take care of a shy guy, because we just got it out of pure luck. <laughs> just definitely go watch the episode if you haven't already, because you'll not understand what I just meant. But um, hmm, where is it? I have it. Oh, it's just we have like a hundred different cards right now, and the plunger was at the very end, so I had to scroll all the way through. But there you go. I just got the plunger. And... All right. Oh my, what is with this music that plays with the plunger? It's sort of gross. <laughs> there we go, we saved it, Toad. Ugh, please tell me you watched that plunger before using it on me. <laughs> Sorry, I thought my, my training prepared me for this. Anyway, I'm the leader of the Green Rescue Squad. Pleased to meet you. We received reports of trouble in deep, deep in the Indigo Underground, so we rushed here as quickly as we could. But well, we got an ambush as soon as we arrived, and my six squad members were all separated. It was so bad we got flattened, creased, folded, crinkled, ripped, torn, you name it. I got stuffed in a pipe with a little green, like a little green spitball, and I'm the leader. This might come as a shock, but I need you to rescue my six squaddies. So the rescue squad needs to be rescued? This happens to you a lot, huh, Mario? Yeah, it does. But if the mini paint star let us here, and there must be another paint star in this cave. Let's go check it out. All right then, let's go ahead and hop in. The bad guys were in in there are tougher than any I've seen, I'd be careful. So I'm guessing, we're, yeah, this will probably be some of the toughest enemies yet because we're sort of going into like their territory. Speaking of which, <laughs> I love the humor in this game. All right then, so honestly, it's just a shy guy, so I'm just gonna use a worn out boot because why would I use anything else? There you go. So let's go ahead and figure this out. Ready, boom, bop, beep, boom, yay. <laughs> Luckily, um, that really wasn't that hard. We got some bonuses for that. I know we're, I think we're getting closer and closer to filling up our hammer again. That was one of the guys who attacked us. There's more inside, be careful. I'm gonna go on ahead. I've got to get some to the rendiv, rend, rendezvous point. All right then, good luck. Don't get beat up again. I mean, if you do, I guess I'll be heading the same way so I can help you out, but we're going down the pipe now. Oh boy, I'm excited. Here we are. Whoa, whoa, look at the bats. Ah, oh, man, they look so cute in paper form. Look at these guys. Oh, who are you throwing around? How much you wanna bet that's one of the rescue squad guys that are throwing it around? What jerks? Oh, man, they're almost worse than the, the toads from last episode. All right, then, so how should we take care of these guys? Why don't we use a line jump? I mean, why not? I wonder when we're gonna face our first boss in the game. I know Paper Mario is sort of well, well known for their cool boss fights, right? So hopefully soon we see that. I'm not sure if we will or not, but I'd love to, you know? All right, perfect bonus. Because I know there's gonna be at least some kind of boss fight in this game, you know? I've seen some footage, you know? I know like one of the Koopa Bros, you know? Um, there you go. There you go, I can just hit you back. There you go, ha ha! They crumbled me up with a, without a second fault like I was just some fast food receipt. Toad number one of the Green Rescue Squad reporting for duty. Now if you'll excuse me, I must report to my captain's location immediately. All right, well we saved one of six. Now there's only five more to go. 
We've rescued one member of the five of the scatter rescue squad. Five minute gal. Yep, exactly what I just said, man. You stay on my line, stay on them. Right, can we do anything here? Yep, get some blue, which is exactly what I need. Luckily, I'm not feeling blue. Oh, look at that, the spike helmet. I'm guessing that's like more of a defensive move then. Interesting. This is interesting. What kind of material is this? It looks like tin foil. And it's a blue question block up there. Don't usually see blue ones. Wonder what could be inside. Ready, get up here. And there's actually a missing paint right here. Get another spike helmet. And this is another spike. Wow, we're getting a lot of them. I don't trust this bat. Oh, I see. What's going on with this toad? He is standing in the wrong dimension. Hmm. Well, let's try to figure this out here. I think this bat's gonna get a little feisty with us once we get up there, and that's a problem. Come on, Mr. Bat. Ah! Wait, I can't really hit you yet, but yeah, let's talk to you. Oh no. Get out of here, Mario, don't talk to me. I'm standing sideways so that swoop up there can't see me. I don't mind. Here. No, no, no. Here. How can I get him, though? Maybe I could just... There you go, I got him. <laughs> that's all I wanted. I wish I could swing my hammer while I'm in the air, but it wouldn't really let me. All right, then. So when it comes to this guy, I think we'll get a spike just to try it out, a spike helmet. And then I got so many mushrooms. You guys have, you can't even see it, the insane amount of mushrooms I have right now. And then, besides that, I'll just use a normal boot. And we'll, we'll be done painting and we'll send that out. All right, ready, set. I don't know how this works. Oh, wait, what? <laughs> I have no idea what that was, well, what? I don't know how the spike works. I might, we have, might have to go back to the dojo for that one. Mario, don't talk to... Oh yeah, the swoop's gone. My tactic worked. <laughs> Tone number two, the Green Rescue Squad reporting for duty. Now if you excuse me, I must report to my captain's location immediately. Good luck. That's the second rescue squad cadet, just four left. All right then. I find it funny they took all the, all the, you know, all the claim there. So we could go this way, but problem is that I don't really need the health, but I do need to fill out the paint spot, so maybe I'll go for that. Right, it's like that, get, oh, I got the triple jump. Okay, oh, and I hit you first, buddy. Oh, I was so ready for you, that was good. So is his friends gonna show up? They aren't. And we just got a triple jump, which is exactly what I'm gonna use, just because that'd be an easy one to use here. Cards ready. I have no idea how much health these guys have, but I can't imagine it's gonna be all that much. But let's find out. Ooh. Oh yeah, okay, you're down. And you're down as well. Yeah, these guys have next to no health, these little swoops. They're so cute though, I love them. And they're down as well. Cool. All right, perfect bonus. Happy Mario. Let's go ahead and pick all of this up. And then, uh, there you go. Get this over here as well. Look at all those coins, mm-mm, good. And that's 599 coins for us, so. Is there any question, or not question marks, I don't know what about. Is there any unpainted areas over here? Darn it, I didn't want to do that. I'm loving this area so far, very cool. Like every area has its own feel, and I love that, because there's a lot of areas so far, you know? And bring me back up. And we're gonna go over this line. And I, it's hard to tell if there's really any missing paint spots here because of how the light hits in. Like everything sort of just looks darker. There is, is there something to the left? It looks like it, whoa, 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 what's happening? Oh gosh, I think we found a secret. Okay, this is a little disorienting. We gotta figure this out really quick. I feel like I shouldn't be going that far just yet. There's no way I can get up there, but I can just bring myself back over here. There's nothing like the paint in here. Like That'd be a little too dastardly. I hope they don't do that. There you go, that was a paintable. Oh man, it's really hard to tell what's paintable and what's not in this area. Okay, let's get back up here. And is this paintable? Doesn't look like it. Get out of here, dude. That bat tried to go straight for me and I was able to handle him nice and good. How many are there gonna be? Just, okay, there's three. Oh man, he's way up there, though. Hmm. Let's do, do we have another line boot? We do, and then I'll use this. Maybe this will be a good idea, maybe it won't, we're about to find out. Ready, set, go. Boom, bop, beep, yeah, I got all, oh man, that was easy. If you can time it just right, it can be a little difficult to time it, but once you do, it's so good. Hmm, and is that it over here? It looks like that's all I can see, so. Oh, ha ha, there is, oh gosh! <laughs> Don't wanna deal with that many swoops. No matter how strong we are, there's only so many we can take. So there was a little secret over there. Hmm. So it definitely looks like we gotta go down here now. But I'm glad we found that little secret area and that little crevice. Got us a few free coins and a few other things as well. 
like this right here. You see like this one right here. That's not a colorable one. That's just like an opaque one. I don't know if that's a color I mean. Opaque, I think is what I mean, no? I'm not sure. Like now you could obviously see the difference. This one actually looks blue compared to that white, but when you don't have that comparison available, it's like they look the same, you know? Hmm. It looks on the right, it looks like on the right again there is some hidden stuff. Oh, maybe not. Now let's get these coins. It's really hard to tell. If there isn't anything hidden here, now I'm like on the lookout, you know? We gotta make sure there's nothing hidden I'm missing. But I don't think there is. It looks like there's some hidden stuff on the top right up there though. We could definitely go and check. But I mean, the game's been out for a few days for you guys, so I hope you guys have been enjoying Paper Mario Color Splash. If you got it yourself, if you guys are playing along, feel free to let me know, or maybe you've played it yourself and now you're watching it, because I know some people don't like spoilers and stuff, I totally get that, but I hope you know that the series will always be here, so if you know you don't want to spoil yourself, you can always just wait and watch it later. The videos aren't going nowhere. Trust me, they're staying here forever. <laughs> if I have anything to say about it. All right, so this is a new guy. Look at how cute he is. I mean, I know I've seen him in other Mario games, Super Mario World to be exact, but hiya! Dang it, hiya! I caught him that time. I think a hammer will be better than jumping on him, maybe? All right, we got that. You have any friends? No, okay then. I'm not sure what this guy's called, but we'll just do a normal jumping on him, because honestly, I think that's just gonna get him to um basically work like a turtle. Oh yeah, like Koopa. Let's find out. I don't know though, he is taking it like a champ right now. Oh, now he's in his shell form. Okay, well now he can't attack me, so I could really do that same thing again if I have a jump. I do, I have plenty of jumps. All right, let's paint it up. I have a lot of unpainted jumps, but honestly, that's not a big deal. All right, boop, you, boop, mm -hmm. yeah, and now he gets out of here. So that was a perfect one, perfect bonus, mm -mm, good. I hope you guys have been enjoying the length of these episodes, by the way. I really like it being about a half an hour mark. I feel like it's just, it's sort of a perfect mix for everything. I've been working really hard to make sure that, like, I have a lot of episodes ready for launch and that they go out every single day. I've been putting a lot of work in this game because I'm having so much fun. I won't deny it, but that's why. Let's see if, let's get a triple jump out for this guy. Maybe we don't need it. I oh, will use it anyways. We'll get the triple worn out jump and see how this works. I find it funny that, like, worn out moves have been some of the most effective for us. All right, now we can try that again. Just like that, that's gonna be nice and good. And I think that'll take that care, yep, take care of the other shy guy. I am stuttering like a crazy person. All right, so, again, all this. And let's fill out that. Oh man, we're getting so much stuff though, I love it. Oh look, there's the two green toads, so, I guess that's their rendezvous part, point. Okay, dude, I'm not ready for you just yet. Hmm. This sort of looks like one, but it's not. Here we go once again. It's hard to tell. So what's going on up here, dudes? Oh, there's a yellow paint sign. Roll call. One, two. All right, so we're still missing four of the rest of you. Yep, we know, we know, don't worry. So that's where we gotta be. All right, I'm sort of getting tired of you guys. Like, I don't wanna be facing you guys all the time. I just wanna, okay, calm it down. Calm it down. Calm it down. <laughs> okay, calm it down. Is this? Bridge unpainted? It's honestly hard to tell. It looks like it is. Okay. Be a little difficult to fill up, but I'm trying. This one guy just doesn't care about me. It's almost filled up. There it goes, there it goes. Ooh, that was good. All right, then there's two more fire flowers. So now we know how to use them because the last episode, I don't know if I want to waste them just yet. I want to make sure to use them against something difficult. Especially when all we have here is washed out dry guys. I feel so bad when they're like this. They just look like so uncomfortable, you know, the poor guys. All right, I'm just gonna send out two worn out hammers because honestly, don't think we need too much more. All right, ooh, yeah! And I almost took out him too. And ooh, yeah, okay. We're good, nice and fine, perfect bonus for us. Almost like, I wanna earn up a thousand coins this time before we have to buy anything more. I feel like that'd be cool, right? Maybe, maybe not. All right, so let's uh, fill up this as well. I'm getting better at spotting these things, but even with that being said, I still haven't gotten all 100% of everything in an area. I can't get this one. I wonder how I can get it then. Hmm. All right, well, I guess we're going against this guy too. Nothing too much I can do about that. But since he's actually in his shell form, that's a great start for us because I can just go like this and then just get him out of here. It'll be nice and easy, nice and fun. I probably shouldn't have even colored it, but I mean, the paint's so easy to come by. Might as well. 
There you go. There's that perfect bonus for us. Unfortunately, I don't see anything more to paint around here. It's hard to tell because, you know, the waterfall's in the way. Oh my. Well, I think we found another toad. Let's save up here. If the game gives me the option, then I probably need it. Hmm, oh, here we go. Here's another one. There's, oh gosh, I hope you're okay. The poor guy, that must have not have been comfortable. Uh, um, we removed the tape. You can come down now if you want to. <laughs> here we go. Oh. Thanks, mate. You're welcome. Um, <laughs> gross, my face is still all sticky from that tape. <laughs> Gotta go wash my face off. Well, not wash my face off. That would be horrifying. <laughs> Town number three, the Green Rescue Squad reporting for duty. Now, if you'll excuse me, I must report to my Gather's location immediately. No problem, we've heard this before. And then just three more rescue squaddies to find, and we've already seen another one. All right, so what's going on around here? I feel like we're gonna have to use our cutout mode soon. All right, whoa. Oh my. <laughs> well, either, how much you wanna bet we're gonna have to fight every single toad before we get him? I will bet you anything that's how it's gonna work out because that is just hashtag zebra luck all over it. Well, I mean, it'll be easy experience and if we actually get that bad luck, I'll try to cut out some of it because you know, you don't want the battles to just be, or the whole episode just to be battling shy guys the entire time, right? I mean, I mean, maybe you guys do. I'm not really sure. Here, but a boom wait. Oh, yeah, second try, nice, uh-oh. Uh-oh. <laughs> well, if we get one of them, we gotta get them all, right? Oh my gosh, okay, I really wish we had a line jump. I don't think we have one. How, okay. This might be the best idea, or the worst yet, but it's what we're doing. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Yeah, let's just go for it. Let's just go for it. Are you guys ready for the super fan? <laughs> of course it is a replica, but that's a-okay with me. Ooh. Replica. Why does it have like replica stamped on it? That's sort of lame. Oh no. Oh no. Oh boy. Oh my gosh. Why does that have replica stamped on it? I don't really like that. Like, I mean, I get that it's a replica, but I couldn't have used the original. Wow. <laughs> Perfect bonus though. Pretty cool. All right then. All those shy guys taking out Mario behind you. Is that. Is what I was going to say, but I kind of froze up, my bad. <laughs> Down number four, the Green Rescue Squad reporting for duty. Now, if you'll excuse me, I must report to my captain's location immediately. All right, see you, dude. We have to be getting close to filling up our hammer. Two more rescue peeps left, we're getting close. Yeah, we're getting close to the full hammer, which is good. So there's not too much over there. Can we actually get over here now? Now the game just doesn't let us. All right, I'll have to keep that in mind. Hmm. Well, what's gonna go on over here? Got that. Wait, is this one? That's not. So easy to get mixed up. Got that. Hopefully we're back. Like, I wanna open up the menu really quick and see for myself. Status. We've already gotten 65% of colorization. So, oh my gosh. Oh gosh, they're playing creepy music too. How do we save them? Um, I can't get to him from here. That's just creepy. I hope he's okay. The music style and everything, like I had like a silent dun, 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 dun. This is so creepy. Can I get up here? Huh, I wonder how I get up there. There's a fire flower though. Yeah, I don't wanna break these blocks just in case I can get up from this way, but I don't think I can, is it? We're not triple jump. Hmm. Got this as well. I don't like this one bit. This is freaking me out. Like there's no music anymore. It's oddly quiet. We saw a horrifying silhouetted scene. When's the monster gonna come out? I don't trust this one bit. Uh, let's go to the left first because we know there's a way to like loop around, I guess. Let's paint that up. Maybe that'll help me this move? Just like that? Ah, it did. Oh, okay, it's gonna move up, not down. That sort of makes sense. Maybe, oh no, 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 it's moving back down. Is it, what is with that? What is this horrible noise I'm hearing? First of all, let's go down here and, and we get ourselves a back card. You got swoop. Now let's go back around one more time. And I think if we go down the one that the purple shaft is going down, we can actually, uh. Come on, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. I don't got all day, I'm Mario. 
All right, and then pop down like that, and then paint this. Just like that, and there's another one painted. There's a boot. Well, good to go. Wait a minute, how do I get this now? All right, we're going up here now. I wanna paint this up. I just don't know why there's no music. It's so mysterious. Got that as well. And what's in here? Uh-oh. The slow slide. Hello? Oh, no. He sucked him dry! Oh, gosh, whoa, okay, okay, hold on! What in the world is with this shy guy? No, run, Mario! Run, run! Okay, fight him, beat him up! Face your fears! Go, Mario, as much as you can! You know what, we're using the fire flower this time. We'll use the fire flower and we're gonna take him down. Cards ready, send it down, get ready for this. Ready, fight! Gosh, this is creepy. Ooh, got it, got it! And he's already down. <laughs> wow, that was actually pretty easy. Nice stuff. And down he goes. And that's a hammer upgrade for us too. Nice. So it's gonna get us from 220 to 240. 240, max pain up. All right then, so let's save you, buddy. What are you gonna sign? All right, I, I can't remember anything. My mind's a blank sheet of, but I do remember one thing. Town number six of the Green Rescue Squad reporting for duty. Now, if you excuse me, I have to report at the Catherine's location immediately and tell them about this traumatizing experience I've gotten. Oh, I also remember this. Take it, it might come in handy. Oh, the one-up mushroom. Why would that come in handy? Okay, now there's only one Miss Goo and we know where he is, I just don't know how to get to him. Maybe I can use that, just maybe. Let's try, I'm also gonna try to plop down here really quickly. And I'm gonna try to, oh, I don't know how to do it. Oh no, I got it, okay, that was just health. Well, I wasted a lot of time on that before. Hmm. Well, I haven't got anywhere close to the need of a, of a what's it called? I don't know what we can use here that's actually going to, okay, we gotta move slightly to the right like this, right? Oh, I think I get it. But I don't, I don't know what we're gonna use here. Like if we gotta use a thing? I'm not sure. But I haven't used, I mean, I haven't needed anywhere close to a one-up yet, so I'll have to keep an eye out. All right then, so we saved him though. He just gets plopped out all here. All right then. All right, you stop it. <laughs> These toads really aren't that powerful, but I'm glad they're doing something for justice, you know? All right, go Mario. Let's go ahead. I'm actually gonna get the information on the one-up shroom. Refills your paint reserves. Plus, it's just fun to look at. So apparently, one-up mushroom doesn't actually it, it refills your paint reserves. Interesting. Let's go ahead and uh, ready up with a stomp, and that really should be it. It's just a jump. Like that really shouldn't be anything more. Any boop, bop, beep, boop, bop. <laughs> All right, perfect bonus and everything. We got it done. I love how every battle area is a little bit different though. Huh, where am I? I was sure I'd meet my end behind that waterfall. I'd about given up. Hey, you tell me if you if I were a ghost, right? Tell number five of the Green Rescue Squad reporting for duty. Now if you'll excuse me, I must report to my captain's location immediately. No problem, dude. You go do whatever you need to do. And now we found all six of them. Boom, we've rescued the whole rescue squad. <laughs> all six of them. All right, let's get back to the leader. And we know who the leader is, so why don't we go ahead and catch up with them? Ah, no, 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 no. All right then, so let's get up here. And look at all this, huh, this is a big rescue squad. Can we talk to all of them? Look, do each one of them have something to say? Okay, no, all right. Join the rescue squad, they said, it'll be fun, they said. <laughs> oh gosh, what is we gonna say? How do I know if I'm not a ghost? Can you see me? Hello? <laughs> Turn number four of the rescue squad. About halfway through, I lost track of who was chasing who. Oh yeah. Tell number three, the Green Rescue Squad. I washed my face, but I still feel sticky. That Bowser tape is tackier than a carpeted bathroom. Uh, a carpeted bed, yeah, that is tacky. Take it from, my, from me, Mario. If you ever get attacked by a swoop, just turn sideways, it never fails. Turn number one, I was crumpled up and the discarded, but your hammer made me whole again, Mario. Hooray. Rokon. One, two, three, four, five, six. And I make seven, all, pres all present and accounted for. Green Rescue Squad, commence Operation Toad Bridge. All units to your positions. Oh wow, so they're gonna make a bridge with themselves? 
Interesting. Oh, nice. <laughs> Thank you, Toads, I appreciate it. Mission accomplished. So they're just gonna stay here for the rest of the time? Thank you, Mario. You rescued us even though you should be the one, we, we should be the ones doing the rescuing. Feel free to walk on us as hard as you want. Okay, take it easy. Really, go to town, I'm serious. Our bond is stronger than any weight. There's no way we'll cause, they're gonna fall over. We'll see about that. Oh no. Oh no, these guys are never up to any good. Oh gosh, they're doing like trampoline gymnastics now. Oh gosh, oh gosh. Oh no. <laughs> All right then, shy guys. You're trying to give me a hard time today? I don't wanna deal with no hard time today. So you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna hit you with a hammer. I think we have a triple hammer way back here. Yes, we do. We got like, so many cards. It's ridiculous how many cards we have. I think the maximum is 99 and I think we're about to hit that maximum. So it's just crazy. All right, fight. We're gonna charge this up and bada boom. Yeah, and charge it up again and bada boom. And one more time, you got it, bada boom. Oh, nice, that was an excellent too. Really a good way to show that last guy who was boss. Perfect bonus, I love cards like that. All right, so there's all those guys taken down nice and easy. Oh no, this isn't good. <laughs> I bought water burp. I bought water burp my nose. Oh, he got water off his. Contact, squatting number three's nose has been invaded by water, requesting backup. So, what do we do now? Try guys ruined everything. Oh, no you don't. I don't want to battle nobody right now. What do I do? I'm not sure. There has to be something. Maybe if I use a hammer? I don't see how that would help, but I'll try it. <laughs> um, like it gives me a fixed perspective here too. Well, I gotta pull him. Oh, duh. Okay. Whoa, there you go. Mario, our debts to you are really starting to stack up. Squad E3, sit trip. Sit trip? My scientists are on fire, sir, but I'll be okay. Uh, it'll take more than a physical force to break our bond of unity. All right, Mario, please proceed. Okay, please. <laughs> Thank you so much. Aw, that's cute. All right, so what's going on around here? A lot of stuff, a lemon? Lemon, hold on. Why is there a lemon? Where is it going? Oh. <laughs> lemon, everybody, lemon. I do not care what card is in that question box. I have fallen down three separate times now. I'm going crazy. I, I know that like, I really hate analog stick controls, but it's not that it, like you can't play this game with a touchpad. Oh my gosh. Oh, it's, okay, that's now the fourth time we have fallen down. I don't wanna go get the star just yet because obviously I wanna be able to get the other stuff first. Cause you know, if I get the star, the game level's gonna end, I'm gonna have to walk all the way back here. So I wanna get the lemon first. I just wanna get the question block too, but apparently not. Ah, man, it's frustrating. Little things like that, right? Little things. So let's uh, go this way and hit that. Wait, oh, got it. And then, uh, yeah, I guess, oh, I guess we could have just walked here. I guess that doesn't matter too much. Oh, there's another paint star here. Interesting. Well, there's the worn out hammer. Let's fight these guys for the lemon. I don't know what we're gonna use a lemon for, but at some point in time, we're gonna need a lemon. All right, go Mario. Tap to select the cards we want. I'm gonna get the triple jump out here and then I'll make it nice and easy, done painting. And then let's go for it, fight. All right, ready? Ooh, yep, mm-hmm, got it. Not a problem, he's gone. Now I'll take care of this guy too. And this is easy. These battles are pretty easy at this point. And I say that and I mess that jump up. <laughs> That's okay, because I got the triple jump, so I got the perfect anyways. 800 coins, man, I'm almost at that 1,000. I just wanna see it. I don't know what the maximum is, is it a thousand or 10,000? So what is, I got the option to squeeze this? Oh yeah, I get to squeeze it. Of course, well, squeeze it, you get lemon juice, right? Ooh, man, that must really hurt Mario's eyes. Like it's just dripping right onto his face. Like that's gonna give him acne. It's a little zest to any meal. Hmm, when am I gonna need that? I'm sure at some point. Okay, let's fill that up. Get myself another card. See, I don't care what's in that question box because I got plenty of cards here. So here's another one. Here's a card right here. Or not a card, but a star. So here's the course clear. We have to head back into the course so it'll pick up the other star now right after this. Now, I don't know if there's any way to just continue the level, but I'm guessing there won't be because it's a Mario game. <laughs> All right, we'll be right back. All right, there's the blue star. What is that gonna unlock? 
Ah, I guess it's just a connection from point A to B. Just in case somehow you unlock that area, but I don't think you possibly can. Like, you, I don't think there's any way you can unlock Blue Bay Beach after this, but that just in case you like want a quicker way around. So if anything, that was a little bit of convenience and you know furthering the 100% completion. Well, let's go back down there one more time and get that starn. All right, then we're finally back. Let me rip this open. And what are we gonna get ourselves? An open door. Oh my gosh, and inside is the yellow star of awesomeness. The course is clear once more, and both stars have got, been gotten this time. I still don't know where else we'd find some, you know, whoa, what is that? What was that peace out token? What in the world? It's not gonna tell me anything about that? <laughs> I don't know, but there you go, there's the yellow star, and that's gonna open up. Ooh, it's like a desert area. Oh my, let's check out what that area is. We won't go inside of it just yet in today's episode. We got it, what is this? What in the world? Oh my gosh, I think I know what that is. I think it's like some rock, paper, scissors thing. A Rochambeau temple has appeared. Interesting. So we got the Daffodil Peak that we just unlocked. We just finished Indigo Underground, 94%. We need 6% left. We just found a Rochambeau temple and number one as well. But before we go to that, what we're gonna do to finish off today's episode, we're gonna go to Port Prisma and open up our mail. All right, Toad, give me that mail. If you can, if you dare, give me the mail. <laughs> All right then, so how you doing, dude? Hey Mario, great timing, you've got new mail. Mr. Mario, thank you for showing me your illustrious card collection the other day. Since you possess a magnificent collection, I was wondering if you might help me out with something. I awaited you in the Action Command Dojo in the Yellow District, the card connoisseur, Toad. <laughs> Remember, you can always reread old letters to summon up the menu, tap up, blah, 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 shut up. <laughs> okay, I don't mean it's so mean. It's just, you guys repeat the same things. <laughs> All right, let's talk to also this Toad. Hey there, Mario, I wanna hear, yeah, let's see if there's anything new. Let's see here, today's headline is Mountain Sage Madness on Daffodil Peak. That's what we just unlocked, right? I think so. Mountain Sage Madness, hmm, that's that Mountain Sage beyond the Indigo Underground, the real steep and rocky one. Hmm, so I need new stories, let's hear it. Okay, yeah, okay. I don't wanna hear about the story I just heard about, man, that's just not helpful. I also wanna go back to the harbor and see like, can we rebuy things? I really didn't like it that when we used the fan thing, it has, uh, what is it called, replacement or something like that plastered on the screen like that completely ruins it, you know? So maybe we can find like the originals and rebuy them from this guy? Cause that would make it much better. Cause I wanna see them all, you know? Welcome back, pal, the ringer. Knew you'd be back now. What can you squeeze for you today? Ah, yes, yeah, see, I can buy them. See, like now I have the plunger, which is 150 coins, and I have the fan, which is 300 coins. And I could buy those, and they don't look to be replacements. They look to be the full things. And there are three pages of them. So we could buy that stuff, but we're not going to right now. Instead, we're gonna get out of here. You must seek a red thing on a red road. It's It cools that which is hot. I have a really special feeling about that particular thing. I think you, it would be just the thing for you. I don't think it means the fan. Like, of course, fans can cool what is hot, but I think it means, well, it's red. The fan was not, the fire hydrant. We need the fire hydrant with the purple toads, but we need to find the last purple toad who's probably on that daffodil hill. So we'll go ahead and do that in the next episode, but right now we gotta focus on going to uh, the dojo here and see what's going on. Uh, yeah, cause uh, what's his name? The connoisseur should be here. The card connoisseur, the CC. Uh, why are you hiding? Some weirdo suddenly appeared and he won't get out of the way, creepy. <laughs> ah, Mr. Mario, how splendid that you would had the good sense to entertain my offer. Follow me, please. Where are we going? Come this way! Oh my gosh. <laughs> Wait, a secret door? What's with this all all this high tech stuff just sitting around in a crummy storage room? This is weird, Mario, but I'm thinking it could be a good weird. Let's check it out. All right, I'll trust you. Uh, don't, don't do me wrong, Huey. Don't do me wrong. Oh my, what in the world is this? I've spent long years of my life designing and constructing this place in order to document the history and culture of Prism Island. Welcome, friends, to a little place that I like to call Prisma Museum. Wow, any an underground museum? This must be one of the those super snobby art places that no one knows about. 
Au contraire, my friend. My mission is to take our collection as accessible as possible. Even a common undergraduate art student should be able to appreciate it. There's this one tiny thing. I don't actually have anything to display as of yet. And having seen your collection of battle cards, my dear Mario, I feel you could be in rather good hands if you chose to donate. Sounds like it's for a good cause. Plus, Port Prisma is my hometown. It'll be nice to visit the museum when I'm old and reminisce about our adventure. Splendid, I knew you could count on someone with such fine taste in battle cards. With that, please allow me to give you the grand tour. The three blue doors in front of you are called galleries, displaying battle cards. From left to right, the blue doors contain basic cards, enemy cards, and thing cards. If you have cards that you can donate to a room, the star above the door will light up. Interesting. To donate a card, simply enter the follow and follow the toad's instructions. So we just donate cards, so that's it. Moving on. The red door to the left leads to the art exhibit. The more cards you donate, the more pieces will be available to add to each exhibit. Uh, finally, the green door to the right leads to the sound exhibit. You'll be able to populate it with sounds by completely repainting courses. Ah, oh, we haven't done any of that. Ask the guide toad in each exhibit for more information, or ask me if you'd like to know about the state of the overall collection. I can't thank you enough for your assistance. Take care. Wow. So we can read these. Basic card gallery collected zero to 60 cards. So I can open this, and we can donate basic cards. Apparently there are 60 different ones. Hey Toad, this is the basic card gallery. We display basic battle cards such as jump and hammer cards. Cards that you've donated can be viewed on the big display in the center. We really appreciate you helping us with the museum. Here are the cards you can donate from your current inventory. All right, so we can, there's a lot of stuff. Basically, all types of cards we got here. But that's the thing I'm curious about. Is a colored one different from a non-colored one? I guess not. Because it's only showing me like one of each. And I don't mind donating this stuff. Like if it's just one of each. Like you know how many time like how many KO hammers I got at this point? Like a firefall is a little bit expensive, but when it's non-colored, it's not a big deal. I don't want to donate this one red hammer I have, the E hammer, because I only have one of them. Quickly wax a single enemy with a hammer up to five times. I haven't actually seen any more of those. I'll donate a mushroom because I have a ton of them. I have a few one-ups as well. I'll, I'll donate a spike helmet. I'll donate that as well. I wonder how much of that of the collection was that right there. Um, thanks for your donation, we really appreciate the help. So I can view this right now, and we can see that we have gotten quite a few, okay, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11. We donated 11 things there, and there's plenty of room for plenty more. So there you go, that's the whole idea with it. Good heavens, what are you doing? Paint hammers on streets of the limits in here, Mario. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> All right then, so. What is this about though? Now it says 11 out of 60, so that's a lot to go. Wow, we. So what's going on in here? So this is like, how, how do we unlock these ones? Welcome to the Prisma Art Gallery. We're able to acquire more art pieces as you donate cards, so please don't be stingy. You can use this display to look at the artwork more closely. Thank you for your help. But how do we get them? I'm not sure. Either way, I think that's where we're gonna head it off today. Uh, because you know, that's really it. You know, we could explore more of this museum, but there really isn't too much there until we donate more of it, which I think that's all I'm gonna donate for today. Thank you guys so much for watching today's episode of Paper Mario Color Splash. If you enjoyed it, make sure you give this video a like, share it with your friends and family, and of course, comment in the comment section below. If you watched this part of the video, make sure you comment Rescue Zebra so I know you've watched the end of the video and that you're a zebra viewer. But either way, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.